Life is about second chances, and a local man knows all too well how making bad decisions can alter your life. After several stints at the state training school and the ACI, Albert Martinez knew it was either time to clean up his lifestyle or else. His motivation, a look in the mirror. We take you to the verified barbershop in Woonsocket in this week's Street Stories. If I thought I was going to be on the news, it would be for a whole other reason. I've done in total 10 years in prison. Um, from drug charges to uh, possession of a firearm charge. A complete 180 for Albert Martinez. He's gone from the streets back and forth to prison until finally realizing enough is enough. Martinez's rap sheet is long. From drug charges to uh, possession of a firearm charge. I was about 18 years old, first time. I did a little bit of time when I came home, kind of just jumped back into the same lifestyle. Before all of that, I did a little bit of training school time, so I did six months in there. So it was just kind of a cycle. The last time I was in, I did about four and a half. And uh, since 2008, man, I've just been on a different path, you know what I mean? I just, just, it was time. It was just time to change, you know? The turning point, a look in the mirror after returning to the ACI. To have these mirrors that are like polished steel. I looked at myself in that polished steel mirror, man. I was, it was just, I just couldn't believe what I was seeing. And that I was looking through the same mirror I looked at when I was a kid. I was 18 the first time I looked in that mirror. So that was just the point right there. I just knew I couldn't go back to it. Martinez wounds all self-inflicted, but he wasn't about to run from his demons. The plan was, you need to get out of here, you need to get out of Winsock. But I didn't do that. This is where I grew up, and this is where it made more sense for me to make the changes. You know what I mean? Like, I, I did a lot of the negative things in this city, and I felt like, like I wanted to turn my life around here, too. My kids order the same thing no matter where we go. Martinez learned to cut hair behind bars. There was some, some older guys in there that had been around for a long time. They kind of took me under their wing and kind of just locked in and taught myself. From cutting hair to performing music, Martinez has toured the country as a hip-hop artist. He knows he's had multiple chances and says he won't blow this one. I was able to open my own business. I have people that actually work for me now. I'm, I'm, I'm a married man and I'm, I'm a good father. I take my kids to school in the morning. And, you know, I'm, I'm just a different person than I was then because I decided that I needed to be a different person. I'm proud of myself, man. It feels, it feels great, man. Like, I feel like I accomplished the goal. So this is, wow, this is completely a flip from anything I could have ever imagined. Martinez says one of his regrets was losing time with his kids. He's also hoping his story will give others hope to stay on the right course.